The silver winning handicap is next. This is a one mile four foot on naught to one ten again. So once again, we've got the group horses in this. Clone Chippendale, James Shea, Grand Forks, Mountain Ridley, Gerard Trapango, Commodity, Darren Thompson, Albus Dumbledore, Dan Hughes, Star Class, Rima, Derek Hinton, Harry Potter, Paul Rhodes, Witch of War, Leon Van Rinsburg, Tunbridge Wells, Paul Rhodes, Bad Manners, David Robertson, Meshvi Ryan, Dan Hughes, Panga Orbs, Darren Thompson, Fighting Edge, Paul Parsons, Voracious Paul Parsons, Swinging Groom, Marty Ligerman, Wassily Kandinsky, Leon Van Rensburg. Leon Van Rensburg's got the bottom white. Then that's a bit of a surprise. And they're away and racing. So there's obviously some really decent horses in this. And bad manners. It's just about the first to show. Swinging Groom is the one at the back at the moment. They can take this one little turn. And the grey Grand Forks Mountain. The other grey Albus Dumbledore. And through as well, but now Tunbridge Wells has gone on. So Tunbridge Wells is going to go into the lead then. From Albus Dumbledore in second, and Grand Forks Mount in third, Fighting Edge is fourth. Then Witch of War, this is officially a handicap, and oh, it, is a, it is a handicap because they're racing off different weights, but in effect, it's more of a group race really because these are mostly group class horses in this. And it's Tunbridge Wells who's in the lead from Fighting Edge and Grand Forks Mountain, then Harry Potter and Tremango. Commodity swinging groom is after that, then Witch of War and Albus Dumbledore looking towards the back. Panga Orbs is now the back marker, but it's Tunbridge Wells who's clearing the lead. Clear by a good four lengths to Grand Forks Mountain in second. Then comes Harry Potter and Albus Dumbledore. Fighting Edge is next, then Witch of War or City Kandinsky is trying to get into it as well. Clone Chippendales towards the back with Panga Orbs and Bad Manners. But it's Tunbridge Wells who leads past the six, leading by two to three lengths to Albus Dumbledore and Meshvi Ryan, the other Dan Hughes Grey coming through now as well. Then Witch of War, Voracious, Trapango, Commodity is trying to get into it. Star Class, Rima as well. The one that's closest to us is Swinging Groom. That one's making a little bit of ground now, but it's Tunbridge Wells who leads as they head down towards the final four. Tunbridge Wells from Witch of War and Wasili Kandinsky and then Meshvi Ryan, Pangarons, Voracious is after that one. And with Swinging Groom at the centre of the track, Star Class, Rima on their inside. Grand Forks Mountain is now starting to motor as well as they pass the three and it's Tunbridge Wells who's clear by a couple of lengths to Witch of War, Meshvi Ryan, Wasili Kandinsky now coming through. Pangarons, Fighting Edge is coming through with a run as well, Batman as he's starting to run on, two furlongs to go, and Tunbridge Wells is still in the lead, but being chased by Grand Forks Mountain, Meshvi Ryan, Fighting Edge, getting in there as well, Wassily Kandinsky is coming through with a run, Batman as he's absolutely flying, but now it's Grand Forks Mountain inside the final furlong, Grand Forks Mountain from Fighting Edge, between the two of them, Meshvi Ryan, Wassily Kandinsky, Batman as he's Fighting Edge, who's got the lead, Fighting Edge is in front, and Fighting Edge is going to cause a big upset and take it, Fighting Edge wins it, Wassily Kandinsky second, then Batman as and Panda all swinging groom might have been fifth. But a race that appeared to be chock full of group class horses has gone to one of the bottom weights. And it's gone to Paul Parsons fighting as the total bottom weight was Eddie Kandinsky was second. So fighting edge for Paul Parsons, a big winner there for him. Second was Eddie Kandinsky for Leon Van Rensburg. Seven stone twelve. Bad manners for David Robertson was third. Grand Forks Mountain Vinnie Gerard fourth and Panga Orbs for Darren Thompson was fifth.